This video is brought to you by Spiderfy, the ultimate bird and bug system add-on for Blender, available for download on blendermarket.com. What's up guys, it's Brad from Light Architect. So earlier today I was creating a little nature scene inside of Blender, and while I was making some progress, I wanted to add a little bit more movement and life to the scene. I had this idea of adding a waterfall in the deep background of the scene to kind of lead the eye somewhere. And rather than building the waterfall from scratch or using simulation data of some sort, all I decided to do is simply grab some stock footage of a waterfall that I liked from the internet, and then I've just imported that waterfall sequence onto a plane, and then in edit mode utilized proportional editing to warp it in 3D around where I wanted it to be on the cliff in the scene. Then I rendered out this waterfall on a separate view layer and in the compositor I've used a difference key to pull out the black so only the whitest parts of the waterfall would be overlaid in the final composite. Now while this wasn't quite enough to sell the effect by itself, I then added some atmospheres overlaid as 2D elements on cards to act as mist from this waterfall and then I ended up getting this pretty interesting shot. Anyways, this is just one quick tip on how you can use 2D elements on planes to enhance your scene without doing a lot of extra work. Think about where you can use 2D elements and warp them around in your scene. As long as your perspective change stays minimal, it can work pretty well. I've seen similar variations of this technique used for adding 2D fire elements, white water from boat wakes, and more. I'll see you next time.